This is the Fox 11 News at noon. <laughs> uh, much more ahead here. Families with children dealing with life-threatening illnesses. Get some cheer today. An organization is decorating their homes for the holiday. This is a special day for a special place in the OC that has changed the lives of some 50,000 people. Today, volunteers lovingly decorated the Miracle Manor for the holidays. Children dealing with life-threatening illnesses and their families not only have a place to live, they get into the spirit of the season as well. It's an amazing thing to think about, somebody not ever having a Christmas tree, right? Something so simple that can mean so much to a family. And we do it here at Miracle Manor where we have 12 families that we're coming together. There's over 100 volunteers decorating the outside, the inside, and then, of course, filling the floor with toys. Yeah. What do you think, Kenneth? Um, I'm very excited because we've never had a full-size Christmas tree before. Okay. <laughs> you look good, by the way. You've been, you've been having treatment since when? Um, since May... Um, March of last year? Yeah. I mean, last year. You March. look amazing. You're doing well. Yeah. You're doing well. Shendi, what does this mean to you to have your family, you and your son here, to have uh, <laughs> this tree here in this apartment? I'm very grateful for all the blessings that I've been receiving, not only to have my son's back life. We feel that we're, um, we're truly loved and miracles really does, miracles for kids really does and, and, and do it's really improved say. your son's well-being. Yes, because we have a community here. It's just not my neighbors. We have a community, and they're very involved with everything. So if he, if they don't see him, they're always asking how he's doing. That's really supportive. He, he, he looks fantastic. You don't have to worry about the bills and things like that. Lindsay here, you're with Miracles for Kids. You are responsible for this tree. You, you help bring all the decorations here together. What does this mean to you? Well, it takes a village. It's not just myself. It may have been my brainchild, but I've had so many awesome volunteers, people who have donated Christmas trees, wreaths, decorations, people who have lent their time uh, to putting all this together, and we're here today to help do this for Kenneth and his family and also all the other families that all live right. at Miracle really Manor. Quickly, the, really quickly, there is one one more thing. Take a look. <laughs> oh, yeah. 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 Santa, what did you bring for Kenneth here? Oh, uh, Merry Christmas, Kenneth. Thank you so much. Uh, Miracles yeah, for you. Kids asked me to stop by and bring you all these wonderful gifts. Uh, Miracles uh, for yeah, Kids yeah. is the organization. Not only do they provide this free housing for these kids that are dealing with these very challenging illnesses, but they decorate the homes and, of course, provide some of the, the donations here, the toys and things for these families, 250 families in the Southland area. If you want to do your part and donate, perhaps you can be a corporate sponsor and adopt a family. It's miraclesforkids.org. Bravo. Yes, yeah, so I'll say it again. Miracles for Kids needs your help. If you want to adopt a family to help some of their financial needs, you go to their website. It's miraclesforkids.org. We also have a link on our website, foxla.com. Oh, Kenneth, he's beside himself. Yeah, Santa. He's a special kid. And you look pretty good as Rudolph, too. Thanks. Thanks, I try. <laughs>